North Korea fire fourth round of missile tests in one week. South Korea AP, North Korea on Saturday fired two short-range ballistic missiles towards its eastern water, South Korean and Japanese officials said, making it the fourth round of weapon launched this week that are seen as a response to military drills among its rival. South Korea military said in a statement that it detected the two North Korea missiles launched Saturday morning from its capital region. It says South Korea has bolstered its surveillance postures and maintained a military readiness in close coordination with the United States. Japan's defense ministry said it also spotted the ballistic missile launch by North Korea. Japan Vice Defense Minister Torito Ino said North Korea's repeat missile firing are one sidedly and persistently escalating provocation. North Korea action threatened the peace and safety not only for Japan but also the region and the international community and are absolutely impermissible, Inno said, calling the fourth launch in one week unprecedented. He said the two missiles were fired eastward from North Korea western coast within about 15 minutes of each other. Both of the missiles rose to the maximum altitude of 50 kilometers and flew as far as 400 kilometers before landing in the Sea of Japan in areas outside of Japan's exclusive economic zone, Ino said. The missile may have been on irregular trajectory, which make tracking more difficult. Saturday's launch came a day after South Korea, Japan, and the United States held their first intrally and high submarine drills in five years of the Korean Peninsula's east coast. Earlier this week, South Korean and U.S. warship conducted bilateral exercise in the area for four days. North Korea views such military drills among its rival as an invasion rehearsal and often respond to its own weapon test. Both military drills this week involved the nuclear power aircraft carrier USS Rondell, Regan, and its battle group. The North Korean missile test this week also came before the after U.S. Vice President Kamala Harris visited South Korea on Thursday and reaffirmed the ironclad U.S. commitment to the secure of its Asian allies. This year, North Korea has carried out a record of number of missile tests in what experts call an attempt to expand its weapon arsenal amid stall and nuclear diplomacy with the United States. The weapon tested this year include nuclear-capable missiles with the ability to reach the U.S. mainland, South Korea, and Japan. That's all for today. Thank you and goodbye.